Hello friends, welcome to this video of coordinate geometry. In the previous video, we learned to plot the coordinate point on the xy plane. Today we will solve some questions related to the same. So let's begin. Plot the given points on the graph paper. Let us draw the x and y axis on a graph paper. One important thing to note is that when we write numbers on the x and y axis, how many units we have to take for 1 cm depends on the coordinate points which we call scale. And before plotting any coordinate point on the plane, we should set the scale. As these numbers are between 0 and 10, we take 1 cm equals to 1 unit. If this point was between 0 and 100, we would have taken 1 cm equals to 10 units. And the point being like this, 1 cm equals to 100 units. Can you tell me what we would have done if these points or numbers were in decimals? Then we would have taken 1 cm equals to 0.1 unit. We will write numbers here taking 1 cm equals to 1 unit. You can also write these numbers in the form of coordinate points like this. 1, minus 3, minus 3, minus 5, 4.5, 1. Friends, we will now plot the first point. 1, minus 3. According to the methods described in the previous video, x coordinate is 1. So from 1, move the line to minus 3 on the y axis and plot the point there. The second point is located at minus 3 on the x axis after moving downwards by minus 5. And likewise, the third point is located in the first quadrant between 4 and 5 where it is plotted 1 unit above 4.5. Let us now take the next question. Plot the given points on the graph. Friends, we will first determine the scale. Like always, let's take 1 cm equals to 1 unit. Now let's plot the given coordinate points one by one. The first point, 0 0.1 minus 0 0.5 will be plotted here. The second point, minus 0 0.3 0 0.6 will be here and the last point minus 0 0.2 minus 0 0.4 here. Now you can see that all these points are in the plane of one unit and quite close to each other which is much smaller than the whole graph. Friends that is why it is said that scale has great importance in drawing the graph. Here all the coordinate points are one or smaller. So here we will plot the points by taking the scale 1 cm equals to 0.1 unit. And now you can see that this graph looks better, clearer and bigger than the first graph. Friends, let's take a word problem. Plot a coordinate point which is at a distance of 3 units from the x-axis towards the negative y-axis and 2 units away from the y-axis towards positive x. Friends, keeping in mind the information given here, you have to solve it. Try to solve this question yourself by pausing the video. The first line says that the point is at a distance of 3 units from the x-axis to the negative y-axis. That is minus 3 to the y-axis and from y-axis towards positive x-axis at a distance of 2 units that is 2 units from minus 3 on the y-axis to the positive x-axis that is it is in the fourth quadrant. Friends, let's end this video with this. In this session, we solved some questions related to plotting the coordinate points in the x-y plane. See you in the next video where we will solve some more questions based on this topic. Thank you.